Hey guys, how's it going? I'm doing um, this thing called Bong Chong Dong Ghost. You know, when, you know, when this thing is funny, people be telling me it's funny. It's, okay, the story is based on true eyewitness events. It was around 11.20 that night. I was dragging myself home exhausted to a tired night study sessions at school. Mm -hmm. But there was no one on the street, which was strange. I see a lot of people. Even at night, since my apartment complex is very big, and he was really scared, I kept walking down on the road while walking home. Suddenly, a study shadow stood me towards me, caught me in the eyes. Although there wasn't anyone around me, I looked up and there it was. If there was, I saw a woman walking in front of me, but she looked at the strange doing the stank like, She's like, oh, yeah, go inside and I'm walking. I could say that she looked flippant. She was living and struggling to walk in front of me. Since he was walking very slow, I seemed caught up with her. But close, I was able to see her even better. She was wearing dirty pink pajamas and looked as if her joints and her body had been twisted. Whereas her head was a mess sticking up to, to everywhere. It seemed so weird when I had stopped walking. I felt like... <coughs> I felt like I shouldn't get any closer to her. The door that I had to go to my survive. <laughs> What the f- <laughs> Oh god. You know, people say that if you're uh, really surprised you can't even scream. That was right. I felt there. That being in the room, I thought, That is my baby! And I go out to listen to air question. Oh my god, I didn't know what I was thinking when I did that. It gave me chills thinking that moment. Cool. I answered pointing as far as I could. Uh, uh, over there. I just wanted her to get away from me. Then she looked towards what I pointed to. I couldn't see her anymore. <sighs> and then I ran into her again. I tried running around to turn around and leave that apartment complex. I could not think of anything but to get to my place to a place where there would be a few around. Then I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> oh <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> I don't remember anything from then. Oh, she's screaming out pleasure. I don't remember anything from then. All. <laughs> I heard that my neighbor finally passed out on the ground and took me home. In 2007, I had a apartment complex in Bong Chong Dong Kawanga. Kawanga a cool soil. A 30 year, 30 year old woman dropped out of the apartment and died on the spot. No one has surname. Cho. Divorced due to her extras, uh, martial fail, she had lost her custody to of her two-year-old daughter and decided to commit suicide. And then said Cho has, was seen walking around that apartment complex several times. And then said Cho was seen walking around that apartment complex several times. And that's it. See you guys later. Remember, subscribe, like, check out my channel, and go that way, Eric. So, see you guys later. Yeah!